think you're at a slightly weird angle here, but I set my tripod up so that when I clean, it's at a really good angle. I don't know. How is everyone's spring going so far? I know it's only literally been like two days into spring anyways, and to be fair, England really doesn't feel like spring anyways because it's flipping freezing. Because it's spring and you know, we're on the spring reset grind, obviously that calls for some spring cleaning. I also have realised that you guys have never seen the whole of my house, like I've not given you guys a tour of my house since I've moved last year, so I feel like I need to do that, like that's just important, like you guys came through the moving journey with me, so you guys need to see the full house. So hopefully this video motivates you to do some cleaning if you've not done any spring cleaning yet, either if it's just for your room or if it's for the whole house or wherever you live, do it because I know it's going to make us feel great. I'm going to start off with my room because as you can see she's not the cleanest. Um, I also just don't even want to show you my dressing table. Just hold on. Like, can you see that? I'm gonna make my bed first um, because, well, it just is easy. I think that's like the easiest thing that you can ever do when you're like spring cleaning. Oh, Pumba! Don't know where the cover to this pillow has gone. I'm now just going to spray the surfaces with the pink stuff spray. You guys I know I love this. I literally use this all the time. And it's just a window and glass cleaner. I just feel like it works really, really well. And then obviously I'm going to use a microfiber cloth with it. <laughs> guys, there's a bug. I freaking hate bugs. What do I do? Can you see it? I'm literally home alone as well. There's nothing that I could do. Okay. Okay, so I've literally just left the bug there because I'm sorry I'm not dealing with that bug today. Like, no. Anyways, I am gonna just, these are my drawers. I actually feel like my drawers are quite organized, I can't lie, like, I've only just recently organized them, um, so I feel like they're looking okay. Um, but what I am gonna do is obviously desk down this. This needs to go in the ensuite because this is literally for the ensuite, it's like bathroom cleaning. It, well like, this made by Mitchell, this needs to go in the bin. Um, and then it's also got some clothes that I've bought for summer. So I'm just going to quickly put these in here because I still need to do like a haul for them. And um, so obviously I don't really want to take them out properly yet and then I sort of forget what I bought. And I'm just going to, oh, didn't realise there was a hairdryer. So next up is my ensuite. Literally, that is my room there. This is my ensuite. She's a bit stressful to clean. So basically, I have no storage for any of my like skincare, toothbrush, that stuff at the moment. Literally, all I've got is this basket from the old house. So it's all just a bit stressful. Um, and then, obviously, I haven't got a towel rack either. So I just kind of chuck my towel down. Those are my PJs from this morning. That's my bad. They shouldn't be there. Um, and then obviously we've got my shower so we're going to do a bit of organising first of just like this area because I feel like that bit just needs a bit of organising and then we'll probably dust it down I'm going to try and like the lime scale on this tap is really annoying me because this isn't even a year old and like it's getting a bit grubby um, I also need to get some new toilet roll I'm going to try and maybe sort out this situation I don't know if I'm going to have to just leave my towels there or not let's begin the bathroom! I basically saw this girl on TikTok that was like given like house rules 
of her house and she was saying how they don't use toilet brushes because they're really gross which like fair enough i completely agree they are really gross but like sorry to be like really tmi but what does she use when like you know there's stuff on the side of your toilet bowl like how does she get rid of that i'm so confused girl if you're watching this let me know <laughs> When I basically get the hoover out, I need to remember to come back into the study because me and Kira basically made a summer like 2024 poster and we put glitter on it. There is now glitter everywhere. So we need to come back and sort that out. So that is basically the study done. The study kind of gets done regularly because I'm always in here. So I'm always sort of like cleaning it up and like dusting it whenever I feel like it needs a good old dust. So we're now gonna move on to my mom's bedroom. Which also probably won't need much because my mum literally keeps her room so tidy. Okay, guys, I am so annoyed. My camera is low key about to die. Um, it's literally flashing at me right now as we speak. So I'm just gonna really quickly do the other room and then the main bathroom. So I'm literally just gonna show you, literally both of these rooms, all they need is literally a dust. They're not bad at all. But this is the um, other bedroom. It's so cute, honestly, I love this room so much because so much light comes in here. Hello, it is many days later if you couldn't tell. Um, and yes, I did not film the rest of the cleaning because I can't lie, my mum cleaned the rest of the house because I was stuck revising, which is great. Anyways, I am now officially going to give you a house tour because it's that time. I did kind of want to do this Vogue style and have you like properly come in and like have someone follow me around, but no one's free right now. So that's okay. You're just going to be you and me and the camera. This is the front door. I'm obviously not going to take you outside the front door because that's stupid. Through the front door. Very beautiful, very lovely. Let's go to the left-hand side first. Oh wait, hold on, we've got two little plants. They're very cute. Anyways, to the left-hand side. So this is our living room. She is super cute and I love her so much. So all of the furniture is literally the same stuff from the old house, like these two and this table, all from the old house. Um, but basically, we've just got like, I don't know, windows. We've got this little pot here. She's super nice. Um, this little TV entertainment wall got put in in december if you've watched any of my vlogmases you would recognize that i was talking about this stuff getting built um so it's lovely very nice it also has like a little led light thing that sort of goes around there and then the top bit we're basically the tv's not mounted up on the wall yet because we want to get a bigger tv so that it actually fits onto the wall um and then we've just got some lovely photos here is baby me guys like what that is actually crazy here is baby me again kind of scary as you leave the living room you basically next to the stairs um is the little downstairs bathroom she is literally just a simple little downstairs bathroom we obviously the whole house is not completely furnished like there's still things that we want to get and stuff for things to be complete but houses take time they're not going to get done in like overnight because things are also really expensive so we do eventually want to get like a nice mirror up on this wall just on top of like this bit just to add like a finishing touch to this bathroom but i think it's quite cute quite simplistic and because it's like it's not huge i feel like it doesn't need too much in here but here's the kitchen um ta-da very cute she's obviously got my bag i literally came home from work and just left it on the side there but we've literally just got the kitchen. I really don't know what else to show you about the kitchen. So I think it's a kitchen. And then through here is just like the little laundry room thing. Um, and then back here is like the cars and the garage. But I'm not going to open the door because I can't be bothered. I'm going to cover all the clothes on the sofa. But eventually we do want a dining table here. But there's obviously not one right now. Okay, and now we're going to move over to here. This is like the little outdoorsy bit. I honestly love our garden. But yeah, no, so this is our garden very cute i actually do love our garden yeah so now we're just going upstairs Woo! this little thing if you guys have been here since the moving vlogs which happened a year ago you will recognize this little like thing 
plant thing um, that I bought from B&M and I honestly love it so much. And then in through here is my mum's bedroom. Hey! Um, it's got this cute, um, what's this called? Mirror. And I honestly love it so much. And yeah. And then she's obviously got these wardrobes that have been built. Also, apologies to anyone that's already seen this in like previous vlogs, but we're doing a whole house tour, so yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, so we got these done by like some people, obviously. Um, and they fitted them in basically. Very cute. I actually love them so much. And then this is my mum's bed. Next bedroom. Here we've got another store cupboard because, you know. And then this is the next bedroom. It's basically whenever like my cousins come over to stay and stuff. Um, so you've literally just got the bed. Very cute. Simple little alarm clock. This little cutie. I mean, honestly, I love her so much. Um, and then we've got another wardrobe that we also got fitted in to here. Um, it's literally, it's another light up one. It's got half a mirror, half of this thing. Can you guys hear the wind right now? It's actually going crazy. Also, I'm wearing this new top from Primark. What do you guys think? I actually really like it. Anyways, moving on. Now, this is like the main bathroom. It says rise and shine. Very cute. Um, this is like tiles all the way up to the ceiling because that's what me and mum like really, really wanted in one of the bathrooms. It's literally nothing fancy, all simple. As I've said, like we still need to get like a big mirror and stuff to put in here. Um, but this is it as of right now. So you guys pretty much already know what these two rooms look like. But for the sake of this house tour, let's give you them. So this is my study. Um, well, the family study, obviously. Um, this is like my desk. The desk is literally from the old house. Everything here is literally from the old house. Well, besides from the walls and stuff. This is just basically where I come and go crazy every day because of A-levels. <laughs> so on the windowsill, we've literally just got like this little sand thing that I made went to the Isle of Wight a couple years ago. The golden temple, this, what's this called? A candle, this little like cute thing that Jaya made me um, for my birthday a couple years ago. A teddy that my friend bought me that reminds me of my guinea pigs. Um, and then this little purple giraffe. Oh shit. This room obviously is a spare bedroom for now. It will have a bed here. We are looking, or like this way, I don't really know. But we are looking to like get this room done, but it's not really a priority at the moment. Like it's sort of like working as it is at the moment just because I need this here for all my revision and stuff because obviously A levels are stress. Um, so we're sort of just like keeping this room in the back burner but this room will not stay like this forever because as much as we will keep it as a study because you know it's always quite handy to have a study at home um, we don't necessarily need this ironing board out like 24 7 if you know what I mean. Um, but yeah so as of right now it's literally just got some chest of drawers that have like my tops are in there, my bottoms are in there. Got a little summer poster that me and Kira made for summer 2024, which is so cute. Um, two Ariana perfumes. And then there's also like this little picture that I made for my mum one day when I was at school and I was really tired. Um, here's little tigs. And then this literally used to be like the book cabinet in the old house. These used to be in the corridor next to the piggies. Um, and now it's here. Last but not least, you guys will have already seen this, but this is my bedroom. Okay, so as we walk in, this is her, this is what you see. I like how it's got a bit of like a cornery bit. I don't know how to explain it, but it's like sort of like off to the side, you know? Um, and in here, obviously got my dressing table bit, um, which also was just done with like the wardrobes and the TV entertainment square this also turns on from a light around the side and it literally just looks the same as my mum's that has a light around and it's very cute i do need to get like a little stool to put here because right now when i use it i like kneel or i just stand and i don't mind standing but not great for the get ready with me you know here i've got my speaker my two little baby jelly cats there is percy i think i called him and dill because the limp and jambi means heart and dill anyways um this is my bed. You guys are going to be like, you always have the strawberry cover. It's just because it gives such spring summer vibes and I just don't want to get rid of it ever because it's just so cute. Um, and then obviously I've got Pumba and I got a new addition to the fam and I haven't got a name for him yet. So little jewel. This light from Ikea. It's just a round globey type thing. I honestly love it. Like it has such a nice light to it. 
and then in here these drawers are not organized whatsoever like why is there a pair of socks in here i've just got like a bunch of my journals books um a dry brush and then in the bottom one is a bunch of socks which is cute on the other side i just have this little like vase full of fake flowers um which i think is very cute and then this little like galaxy led light thing this is the sickest thing ever i honestly love this um and then once again top drawer is just like you know your, your stuff um and then the same with the bottom drawer which is lovely this is my wardrobe hello guys i was about to say we're done but we're not done because you have my own suite sorry right in here ignore the towel please just just ignore the towel this is my ensuite my beloved ensuite um it's your bob standards on suite really i do really want to get a mirror here and then maybe like drawers here to keep my stuff or like hanging shelves i'm not too sure i got this little cute i don't know leaves and i just thought it looks nice because like they like sort of fall over the edge um and then we've got my shower which is great that is the end of this video i think i'm gonna now switch most of my content to like school exam related things just because it's a lot easier to film that sort of stuff at the moment rather than going out of my way and recording other things so i know that's not great and it doesn't apply to all my viewers but i hope that some of you still find this enjoyable like me revising and doing a level stuff because i know that it's quite relatable and it will be good for people to look back to and sort of be like oh my gosh you know like in the future i don't know thank you so much for watching this video guys i love you all and i hope you have a great day bye